So a few guys so far asked me like, how am I managing my work? So I have a few clients, coaching clients, and I'm working on a few resources. I'm working on these videos. I'm working on courses. I'm working on like SMA and stuff like that. So how I'm managing my work. So I still have like a lot of the day free to actually read, to work out, to go outside, to talk with family, to chat with friends and stuff like that. Still living like almost like a normal life. I, I could say that because it's not like I'm living frugally, uh, never talking to friends, like being an outcast or something. Not really. I'm living a pretty normal life, I would say. Uh, just focusing on more important things. So how I'm managing this to still be so productive, get so many things done, but still have a ton of free time. More free time than some guys who are wasting time like on TikTok and stuff. So if there is a task that needs a ton of focus to get done, like, for example, this could be recording a really difficult video or making a script for a really good video or making a script for a course or making a resource for like something like here in Notion now I have opened uh, this resource for productivity. There is a ton of text here. It's like I can check out the word count. It's like uh, 2,400 pages. I'm not really sure if you can see it, but never mind. Uh, 2,400 pages, uh, words, not pages. Uh, so a really big word count. There is a ton of things written here. And it's like, it has also like a customized text, uh, bold things, like underlined things and stuff like that. Italic also images added and stuff like that. So it's really something uh, like a masterclass or something. It's literally a written course, a ton of value in there. So how, uh, how I make something like this? I make uh, in my plan for the day, I will put deep work sessions. So uh, the best is to do them in the morning. So I have a morning routine, let's say, and after that I have a deep work session that is like one, one and a half hours long where I will work on this. And I will have these like every single day. And for example, in a week, I will get done this one huge resource about, for example, productivity or like discipline and stuff like that. Uh, that's one type of work, deep work. But uh, as I have coaching clients that I need to keep accountable every single day, just like chatting with them, checking how they are doing currently, uh, that type of work is not something that you really need to sit down and like focus. So I can literally do it while taking a shit. So how do I manage those things is uh, literally I will open WhatsApp to reply to my clients and send the messages to them when I'm doing something that doesn't need my full attention. So maybe while eating, while taking a shit, while walking outside, while sitting, not doing anything, while resting. Literally, like while doing pretty much anything, I can open WhatsApp and check in with my clients because that is shallow work. It doesn't need any special focus. Uh, but when I need to, need to like record videos and stuff, I will just be uh, alone in a room without any distractions, like right now in a flow state. So I can focus on that, similar to deep work, but needs less uh, focus energy compared to making these huge resources where I need to like brainstorm and stuff like that. Uh, also editing uh, photos and videos, maybe for SMA and stuff like that. It needs some focus. Uh, so I should be alone in a pretty peaceful room, but still I can do it later in the day compared to the deep work in the morning that I do where I need to focus on like writing a script for a course, maybe let's say. Uh, the next type of work is like doing coaching calls with my clients. Uh, this usually is not hard for me, so I can do it pretty much any time in the day. I just need to, be, need to be alone in a room without any distractions and I can focus on it easily. Thanks to meditation and reading that uh, recovered my mind uh, from being fucked up. So my mind uh, is not fucked up right now, so I can focus on it easily without getting like distracted and mind wandering. So I can listen to a client easily for 20 minutes straight, just them talking and remember everything and then reply properly. So that's how I manage my work. So mostly I will make a daily plan. So if I uh, need to do a call tomorrow with a client, I will already know at which time I will do it. I have it planned on my uh, daily to-do list. Uh, then if I need to get something hard done, it will be in the uh, early morning deep work session. If I need to get something shallow done, like messaging clients, I will do it during the day. I will also have it on the daily to-do list to not forget it. And if I need to do like editing a video or editing photos, I will have it on my to-do list to do it like during the day. But you can also do it during the morning, whatever you prefer. 
So yeah, uh, it depends on uh, what type of work you want to do. So you will experiment. I tried doing deep work later in the day. It doesn't really work. I tried just messaging clients first thing in the morning. It uh, it gives me a lot of dopamine compared to these other harder activities. So it's actually much better to do the harder activity first and then message my clients later because messaging is much easier. So yeah, I hope that a few guys who asked me got their answers that you will know how to structure your day if you have any work. If you don't have any work to do, um, make yourself busy by reading more. I have sessions of just reading. It doesn't seem productive because you don't earn anything from it. But if I wasn't reading, I would never get coaching clients because my coaching is based on my reading and my own self-improvement journey. So yeah. Yeah, guys, see you tomorrow.